Hey guys, I am here today to talk about styling long denim shorts. I almost always wear like shorty shorts, like shorty denim cutoff shorts. It is far and away my favorite style of cutoff to wear in the summer. Here's the thing, long shorts in general are a huge trend this summer and long denim shorts have sort of been like coming on for a while now, but I haven't really given them a serious look. So now it's time. I actually went through and I ordered like 10 pairs of long denim shorts. I tried them all on. There's an article that we can link to the results of that styling session. The result of that huge try on was two pairs of long denim shorts that I genuinely loved, but both are like, one is aggressively long and the other one is like all the way down to my knee. For some reason, I ended up not liking the mid-length shorts at all. I mean, I guess I like my shorts extreme, either denim underwear or really long. The top two pairs from my denim short try-on are a pair of Pistolas, a new to me brand, and a pair by Anita Bing, who, you know, I know and love. The first pair, the Pistolas, they're not stretchy, but they're super soft cotton. They have cool distressing and a sort of overall like slouchy boyfriendy vibe. Even though the waistband is still kind of nice and nipped in, they do have this sort of like easy, borrowed from the boys feel. And I love the look. I love the look, especially tailored pieces or fancier pieces. So these are, these were easily one of my favorites. The second pair of shorts, Anina Bing's shorts, are basically gauchos on me. I'm only five foot two inches tall. And so I might actually end up chopping a few inches off the hem, but I kind of like the longer length, so I'm gonna play around with it and see if I can get it to work, because it's kind of different and fun. These have the deconstructed waistband. They, it looks like they just like kind of chopped it off. The vibe here is very similar. Like there's still like a boyfriendy borrowed from the boys look. However, it's a much more tailored version of it and it is decidedly very like fashion girl. So let's get started. One is an oversized button down with some cute heels and a sort of like minimalist little clutch. The whole thing comes together just kind of nicely. I like how the oversized shirt, this is actually Mike's, but I like how the oversized shirt sort of reinforces that boyfriend vibe and to offset the boyfriendy vibe, I like a little like lacy bra peeking out. I like the killer heels and the cute bag. This one is basically foolproof. It works really well with the Anina Bang more tailored version of the long shorts as it does with the cool distressed denim shorts of the Pistolas. Outfit two, we're gonna amp up the girly factor even more. Ooh, look how like these like slouch down low. That's kind of fun, right? I like the boyish shorts with a girly little top, a cute little clutch, and fun shoes and earrings and all the like fun going out curly things. It has that nice mix of like feminine and a little bit more masculine and it works just as well with the tailored pair of shorts as it does once again with the more distressed shorts. Outfit combination with long shorts, number three. I wanted to find a formula that I could wear with flats because frankly, I wear flats most of the time. And I also wear graphic tees. So that was an easy, easy win. And I found that the secret, for me at least, to styling up these like really long boyish shorts, especially with graphic tees and flats, is to keep the accessories like a little bit more elevated. This Claire V crossbody bag is such a win. It always looks good. It's technically a belt bag, but I like wearing the belt bag, you know, crossbody. It just sort of elevates the look. And the shoes I'm wearing are by Brother Bellies. They just add like sort of like a polish to any outfit. It helps, you know, feminize the look and it just makes it look more intentional. Once again, whether I'm wearing the sort of like darker wash, tailored and into big shorts, or whether I'm wearing the Pistola distressed denim shorts, the elevated accessories just pull the look together completely. And yeah, it's like, it's a virtually foolproof look.
So outfit number four is probably the outfit I will wear the most often. I love my Vans in the summer. I love my straw bag in the summer. I basically wear those two pieces with almost everything. In order to make my usual combo work well with the long denim shorts, I found that as long as there's something on top that's either like sexy or elevated, it works. My top pick is probably some sort of crochet top, given that, you know, for summer of 2022, there's tons of crochet and the texture is amazing. It looks so cute with the straw bags. The crochet has like a casual vibe, which pairs really nicely with bands. I actually really like it over top of my favorite like hand-wrote camis that I wear basically almost every day in the summer. This outfit formula works whether I'm wearing my long Anina Bing dark wash shorts or if I'm wearing the Pistola light wash shorts. All right guys, that's it four foolproof outfits for long denim shorts. If you guys have opinions on whether or not I should tailor these, I'm thinking, I can't decide if I should leave them as is or maybe take a couple inches off the bottom, you know, leave me a comment below. I'm genuinely curious. If you liked this video and wanna see more, be sure to like and subscribe below. We so appreciate you. Thanks.